Hello everyone, I'm Kanushka, back with another tutorial, and today I'm going to show how we can make like a normal tech slideshow or like a normal image slideshow using Combine and SwiftUI. So let's go and start coding. So right here, I've set it up the project, and I've also added this text Swift file, and right here you can see there's a text object. Okay, so for easing things up, I'm going to declare like a struct, a struct of Okay, so I have declared like an info struct and I will like also I'll also import the Swift UI and I will say struct info struct and here I need the two properties that is color and string. Okay, so I will declare like an initializer color string string and I will say self that string equals to string string so okay sorry that the string sh the color should be a color type sorry okay now this will work okay it's working now right here I will declare an observable object. So I will say class text width. I will name that observable object text width. And I will say observe. Obs Why is the object? So I will declare it to the observable object. And I will declare like a published variable. So this is combine is used for like taking and giving data from a view. So I will say published var and I will say info info of type info struct so for initializing I'm doing like a red color and I will say hello and I will initialize it with nothing a public initializer and I will I will I will start with a timer that changes the text and background color of the view every three seconds. So I will declare a timer and I will start like a scheduled scheduled timer and I will use this block. Uh, time time interval should be like three. Repeat is false. I don't want that to repeat. I don't want that to repeat. And I will say timer. And here is where the twist comes. So I will write here, I will say current slide equals to zero. So, okay, so also we need like all the data in one. So right here, I've declared an array of all the data, which we are gonna use right here. So we are gonna incorporate all the logic afterwards, but just let me declare this combine object right here so I will say observable object public war items and I will declare that to text script also I will say that this this text instead of saying the text is hello world I will say the text is items dot info dot text string so I will declare like I want to set the background color of this so for that I will just declare like a v stack and I will say background and the color the background color will be items dot info dot color so everything is completely set up right here and I will go there and do like the logic stuff. I'm declaring like a dummy struct right here which says basically nothing because we are not gonna use that. Okay, so right here I will say and I will also declare this update text update text function which will like it will it sets a condition that if the current 
slide is if the current slide is less than all data dot count minus one then it will say current slide current slide plus it plus equals one also it will uh, it will change the okay sorry here there's a mistake it will also change the info to all data and it will set it to the current slide okay it's all set the last thing i just need to do is i want to like declare the same thing right here declare the same thing right here self dot current slide and i'll just have to call this update text pin so let me run this and things should work this time okay there, there is an error it says okay we just need to add like the self thing Okay, so before running, I want to make this uh, make this change. That I want to declare the content view. I want to declare this restax frame, which should be like for now I'm doing to like five hundred and height to be like four hundred and alignment to be center. So let's see how it's going. Okay, so it's loading up. Let's see what it brings. It says hello. It should change it every three seconds. Okay, so I figure out there's a glitch right here. Okay, I figured out the problem. The problem is true. We have set the repeats to false. So it won't run again. So if I set it to true, then it will change the text like every three seconds. Let's see if it works enough. Fingers crossed if it's gonna work. Let's see. This should work actually. Hey. Hey hey. Bonjour. And a mistake. Okay, so it's completely it's it's working completely fine. And at the end of this, let me explain the whole logic. So first we declared like the text. We declared like a bunch of okay. So first we declared the info struct and we declare all the data in that. Then we declared the text. We declare all data in which we declare like all the things we want, the text, dummy text. Then I declared an observable object, and then I declared like an info text right here, like info struct, and I declared like a current slide, so it changes the slide every three seconds. I set it the uh, repeats to true, and the timer, and, and right here I I set the current I set the cu current info to like current slide, and I call this function, which basically just increases the current slide if it is less than one less than all data dot count which works all the time and right here in the content view i declared like this object observed object uh text swift and i set it like the background color to be items dot info dot color and the text to items dot info dot string So this is Kanushka, thanks for watching the tutorial and stay tuned, happy coding!